if we don't act here soon, the United States is going to be left behind. This tweet from John Deaton, and this is the unfortunate situation in America. He says, the United States is being left behind, full stop. Crypto regulation is not coming. I've seen some very smart people say things like, when will we get, or when we get regulation soon? I hate to be a Debbie Downer about politics in the United States, but I don't see sensible crypto regulation being passed into law anytime soon. I believe the first or second quarter of 2025 is likely the earliest it could get done, and I may be overly optimistic with that time estimate. The market will continue to receive guidance only through judicial results from the SEC's regulation by enforcement policy. In other words, guidance will come by federal district court decisions like library, Ripple, Dragon, Cho Dragon Chain, etc. The industries must come together to help the fight uh, to fight the SEC's enforcement only policy. This is why Naomi Brockwell agreed to let me represent her in the library.com case. Yes, the library summary judgment decision has been made and the SEC received a total victory from the judge's ruling. The SEC conceded on the record that many, if not most, Library token holders did not view library as an investment and that they utilized the token for consumptive use. However, when asked by Jeremy Kaufman and strongly encouraged by the judge to provide clarity regarding secondary transactions of library, the SEC has refused. I have the script from the November 21st, 2022 hearing, although I'm not allowed to release it to the public yet. So John Deaton's sitting on some documents. Maybe John, John must have a red folder too. This is exciting, folks. I didn't know this. John says, I have the transcript from the November 21st, 2022 hearing, although I'm not allowed to release it to the public yet. The words secondary market transactions and the word clarity were uttered on the record more than a dozen times, each mostly from the judge. The SEC's response is the secondary market is not part of the case in controversy and that the SEC doesn't give clarity. The SEC is seeking a permanent injunction that does not distinguish between library and its executives and users of the platform or secondary market transactions. On January 30th, we have a hearing to discuss the issue. I have filed an amicus brief and an appearance in the case. Naomi Brockwell has never purchased an LBC token, and she has never sold a single token. She uses the tokens to help generate views for her videos. She didn't even know the tokens had a monetary value when she first acquired them. Library Coin is the quintessential utility token. Professional crypto traders have never heard of LBC. It's not an investment for its users. Library and its CEO have agreed to burn all pre-mined tokens, but the SEC won't budge on offering a no-action letter for users or an official statement or any type of clarity whatsoever. People have told me that I'm likely fighting a losing battle. Maybe I am, but what else do we do? We have to fight all these court battles because clarity through legislation is not coming. Congress, I triple dare you to prove me wrong. Wow. Wow. So John's sitting on some documents, some transcripts, okay? And, and we're going to hear them soon. And we're going to see this library case is not over, right? This, this library case, the judge has made a ruling, right? Where uh, initially we take a look at this and we see that the SEC has had a complete victory, right? But once again, they still haven't provided clarity. So, th so they're making their motion basically here against library. And they're not willing to work with anybody. They're not willing to provide clarity. And what choice do we have? And so I want to say God bless John Dean for being an American, an American lawyer who's stepping in to the legal battlefield for us. And we stand behind you, John. And, and, and we wish that uh, we can see this through and we can get a level playing field after clarity is provided. Whether that has to be fought out in court by gentlemen like yourself or whether Congress is going to get its act together. God bless you for being a man who is standing up, stepping into the battlefield, taking a stand. What choice do we have left to do here? And John, I just couldn't say it more. God bless you. We stand behind you. We're going to continue shining the light. We're going to continue calling out our congressmen and women who are supposed to be representing the people of America. 
We're going to continue to call out the SEC. So God bless John Deaton. I am your host, Zach Rector. I really appreciate all of the love and support. If you want to support the channel, just remember that you can start by smashing that thumbs up for me, sharing this content far and wide, and everything else is at my website.